Hello friends, structural engineers and architects can be found working together on building projects. Both are responsible for bringing a design concept from drawing board to completion. However, their tasks are completely different. Architect is the first person to plan the building as per the owner's requirements. Then comes structural engineer who arranges the position of beams, columns and other structural elements from design point of view. It seems that architects come up with an idea and then make a plan that engineers help them execute. After the architect creates the blueprint of building plan, the engineer goes over the architect's design and decides what materials must be used from structural point of view to bring the architect's design to completion and to make the building strong enough for use. Generally, architects view structural engineers as lack of vision and appreciation for aesthetics. They consider them as technically competent but otherwise underqualified and uninspired. While structural engineers typically view architects as idealistic and ignorant to the laws of physics and budget, working together can be a collision of conflicting personality types and professional goals. So in this video, we will discuss the differences between structural engineers and architects, their roles and responsibilities. So let us start. Scope of work. Structural engineers are responsible for the strength, durability and stability of the structure. They consider all the structural loads like gravity, wind, snow, rain, seismic, dead load, live load, earth pressure temperature and traffic etc. while designing the structure in order to prevent loss of injury or life. Structural engineer's main responsibility is to ensure the design is safe and meets all appropriate building codes. On the other hand, architects are responsible for aesthetics of any structure. Architects design the space to meet clients' needs as well as the aesthetic appearance of the inside and exterior of the building. The goal of an architect's design is to satisfy the customer's requirements, making the appearance of the structure to the customer's liking and performing quality work. Design While designing, engineer has to follow respective country codes on various design parameters and materials of construction etc. to arrive at the sizes of structural elements. They also design structure to be stiff enough in such a way that it should not deflect or vibrate beyond acceptable limits. On the other hand, while planning the interiors of any building or when planning for a municipal authority, the architect needs to know some local building bylaws, building codes and wind flow directions etc. The architect needs to comply with local planning and zoning laws such as required setbacks, height limitations, parking requirements transparency requirements like windows and land use. Softwares The basic softwares used by structural engineers are StadPro, AutoCAD, Safe, RISA, eTabs, etc. Whereas the basic softwares used by architects are AutoCAD, Revit, Archicad and other building information modeling softwares, etc. Basic Degree the education of structural engineers is usually through a civil engineering bachelor's degree, whereas the basic degree required to become an architect is bachelor's in architecture. Involvement In planning stage, structural engineer is not fully involved, but he may be required for suggestions. On the other hand, architect is responsible for planning of all the rooms, lawns, canopies, etc. as per owner's requirements. Interior Works Structural engineer is not involved in interiors of any building, plumbing and sanitary etc. Whereas architect is the one who decides interior finishes, types and mix of doors, windows, tiles, flooring pattern, interior furniture arrangement, exterior aesthetics, plumbing and sanitary arrangement, lightning layouts etc. Duties the main role of a structural engineer is to calculate weight of structure and specify size of structural members such as column, beam, slab, foundation and other supporting elements of the building. Structural engineer decides what type of foundation has to be used, whether it is pile foundation, 
मैट फाउंडेशन इट्स विड्थ डेप्थ एक्सेट्रा स्ट्रक्चरल इंजीनियर ऑल्सो डिजाइन्स द रेनफोर्समेंट स्टील विच हैज टू बी यूज इन ऑल स्ट्रक्चरल मेंबर्स लाइक कॉलम बीम स्लैब एंड फाउंडेशन वेर एज आर्किटेक्ट डज नॉट डिसाइड द साइज ऑफ बीम और कॉलम बट कैन ओनली रिक्वेस्ट स्ट्रक्चरल इंजीनियर फॉर अल्टरनेट चेंज इन फ्रेमिंग if required from aesthetics point of view the architect will typically review contractor's shop drawings and other submittals prepare and issue site instructions job duties of a structural engineer mainly involve the design and inspection of building projects structural engineers create drawings use computer modeling and build 3d models of structures to determine safety requirements weight load and size approximations During inspections a structural engineer studies the building site examines soil strata to determine load factors and solves the problems when building issues arise an architect works with clients construction managers and structural engineers to ensure that the original design of the project will come to fruition architects are directly concerned with building aesthetics color and materials to be used provides advice about strategies to reduce noise space appropriation related to personal or business needs of clients and its overall functionality before engineer can approve architect's design engineer has to analyze the design and select materials that can safely uphold the structure an engineer takes the blueprint presented by an architect and determines whether it is possible to build or not and what are the best materials to use in designing any structure an architect has to plan out his ideas by making a scaled drawing the architect also provides initiatives in a wider environmental sense such as making provision for low energy transport natural day lighting instead of artificial lighting natural ventilation instead of air conditioning pollution and waste management use of recycled materials and employment of materials which can be easily recycled in the future The different types of structures designed by structural engineers are buildings, dams, power plants, roads, bridges, oil and gas plants. Also one can do freelancing after getting structural license from local municipal body. This license helps structural engineer to vet the engineering drawings. On the other hand, the different types of areas the architect is involved is town planning, smart city projects. safety aspects of society buildings and landscaping one needs to obtain license and can also become chartered architect architects must listen when the structural engineer warns against something whether it be a structural issue a construction problem or a budget concern and yes engineers need to realize the talent and vision that architects bring to the table and use the knowledge that they possess to create a workable solution So friends see you in the next video thanks for watching